Hello, I'm Scott Mills from BBC Radio 1. This is Chris Stark, and we're in a room with Kevin Hart and Dwayne The Rock Johnson about to play Playground Insults. Oh, they are no, staring each the, other out. This is the one. The it's atmosphere in here is very tense. You mm -hmm. can cut it with a knife. That's yeah. why I'm drinking my tea. Kevin Hart is drinking from the smallest teacup in the world. Well, it's befitting. It's purposely. Was that an insult? I don't like big cups. Mm -hmm. This is a safe zone. What gets said in this room goes absolutely no further. All right. You can feel the tension already. Okay, here we go. Kevin, serve. DJ's got the same nose as Janet Jackson. Here we go. The, the, he's, he's taking the gloves off now. Yeah. This is it. All right. <laughs> Kevin, uh, Kevin looks like a buffed uh, uh, Urkel. A buffed <laughs> Urkel? <laughs> okay. I'm going to go with... Uh, your head looks like, looks like a long breast, like a long what just, succulent what's, breast. Like with the areola right on my yeah, forehead. Yeah, areola is right on your forehead. You got a nipple head. That's fucked up. <laughs> Guys, don't encourage him. That's He's got up. a titty head. Okay. He's <laughs> <laughs> got a titty head. That's going to stick. That's going to stick. That's going to stick. If that a, shows up on my timeline, then you got uh, a Portuguese you got a, that's titty enough. Head. That's enough. <laughs> don't put a culture on I it. Put a culture on don't, it. <laughs> just a titty head is fine. Portuguese titty head. I really, uh, all, right. all right, all right. You know how sometimes Sometimes when people get under your skin and you just hate them. I'm not what saying, is that? I'm what not are you saying, saying it's you. I'm That's just saying there's word. sometimes where you just really hate somebody. Fine, sometimes I'm tell you, the world. you have that personality when you walk in Fine. and you're like, you think everyone's like, hey, there's Kevin, Fine. great. But you know. Dwayne Johnson. Don't say it. Breath smells like shit on the regular. Uh. And nobody knows this. You wanna know where the eyebrow raise came from? It came from the reaction of people when he goes, hello. And everybody goes, yeah. <laughs> That's what The Rock is cooking. Shitty okay. breath. <laughs> okay, don't encourage him. All right, my breath is not shitty. Look at these teeth. Don't talk about teeth. You know I'm insecure about my teeth. Like, about you guys my ever teeth. heard of Invisalign? Huh? Okay. okay, Kevin's now the spokesman for Invisalign. Because <laughs> his bottom row of teeth, like, they're having a fucking meeting and they're all unhappy right now. <laughs> right I now. confided in you with that. I told you. Well, uh, look at the pictures lately. He's so talking like this and he's trying to hide it. Yeah, it's, it's, okay. it's very true right now. Yeah. Wayne Johnson has women thighs. <laughs> he's got women thighs. <laughs> What does that mean, though? Because these are sensitive times. I'd love to hear that. What does that mean, that I got women's size? It just means that you have very... No, but I mean, go ahead. It sounds like that's a wonderful rabbit hole you should go down right now. You know what? I don't need to explain myself. Please explain it to the world. What does what women's thighs mean? This isn't an explain game. This go is ahead. insults. <laughs> Women have nice thighs. You shouldn't have their thighs. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Now, shut up, man. All right. uh, okay, here's okay. a good impression of Dwayne Johnson, the people's hero, okay? Mr. Dwayne, could you sign my belt? He's like, oh, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> he, he throws kids off with signals to take their mind off of what they asked for. Mr. Dwayne, can I get an autograph? Okay. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> kids confused as to what happened. <laughs> well, the truth is, it's hard to insult Kevin because, you know, he's one of my best friends. That's right. Right? We, we mess around with each other a lot. Big fan of all of his movies? Uh, or? Well, yeah, I loved all of his movies. That's yeah. the thing. I mean, yeah. Home Alone and, no, you that's know, not my I movie. loved that one. Those uh, are my Beverly movies. Hills Cop. That's he Eddie Murphy. Away. What are you talking about? That's not my movie. Oh, you know what? It, uh, no, no, no. Pootie Tang okay. was great. This is, that's was Chris Pootie? Rock. Now uh, you're just naming other black yeah, comedians. I, You're not even no, trying. But you, he You're not even great. trying. That is great. Tell you a little secret about Dwayne. He was Dwayne, great nobody Smurfs. Knows. Uh, he was wonderful in that. Dwayne's got a tattoo right above his ass that says, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Hart, <laughs> Dwayne Johnson, thank you for your playground oh, insults. Thank you, dude. <laughs> of course, of course, all, all jokes aside, man, look, you know, there's nothing but respect and admiration. That yeah, goes for this likewise. guy, man. Yeah. I would love to call him a dickhead for the rest of this interview, <laughs> but I, I love the jackass. But I love the dude too. I gotta agree with you. You know what I mean? We're, we're very similar in so many ways. We share a lot of the same values: hard work and discipline and drive, and you know, having a great time, loving making people laugh. I'd love to sit and call him a real piece of shit <laughs> for the whole time, but you know, I just I can't. Thank you guys. Thank, Thank you guys. Very much. Thank you. It was good. Hello, it's Scott Mills here. I hope you enjoyed that. You can listen to my show weekdays 1 till 4 p.m. on BBC Radio 1 or anytime you like by downloading the BBC iPlayer radio app. Yeah, oh, did, 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 did. I told you he just breaks shit. Didn't yeah. I tell you that? One.